Hey what's up everyone welcome to this video and this video is to inform you that Ether SX2 emulator is released for Android and it is available on Play Store I mean Play Store to download and as I told in my previous video that it would be released on 4 December and yeah it is released today and it will be completely free to download and play and you won't even see ads while playing so before uh, playing on this emulator let me tell you that it needs PS2 BIOS file and it doesn't come uh, with a pre-downloaded BIOS and you can only play games that are already I mean you need to have a file of that game and you will be able to play the game that's it N nothing more than that so first download this emulator from play store by the way you can find the download link in description and its download size is just 6 megabytes uh, which is not uh, uh, so much I mean it's very less now let me show you how to download the ps2 bus file which you will need to set up the ether sx2 emulator so first in order to download this bus file you have to click on the link in the description and your bus file will uh, start uh, downloading and now we need a game which we can run on our emulator so i have only i already have a game demo file if you want to download this to try how will it work you can find the link for this game file in the description now let's run the brand new Ether SX2 emulator and here you will see the interface. Just click on next then next and here you will see some basic options. We will see them later. Click next. Now we have to add the PS2 BIOS file. After adding the BIOS file, you have to click next then select the game directory from here after completing all the steps. Uh, you will be directed to the main screen now. Uh, for some reason I don't know why but I am unable to see my game here. So I started it manually and as you guys can see like I am amazed to see it. It started I mean literally it is working on my device. Uh, it shows Sony Entertainment and let's start the game and as you guys can see our game has started. And it is lagging a lot because I have a uh, low end device to run this simulator anyways i hope you like this and i didn't told much about this emulator so i will make another video about it in which i will explain in detail all the settings and all other options and also this video was made in a hurry for some re personal reasons uh, so i will bring another video which will be a proper video about ether sx2 emulator and also like and subscribe and turn on all notification for these kind of videos i hope you liked my video and uh, this was the first voiceover i am doing and i'm really nervous while speaking i don't know what i'm speaking so anyways goodbye